Memory Mixer uses layers similar to traditional scrapbooking. You can see these flowers here are sitting on top of this photo. If I click on that, the gray boxes will come up. That shows what item is actually being selected. If I click on this frame, you can see now this is the item being selected and that it is actually sitting on top of that photo. Let me just drag it over here and you can see what I mean. So that has a transparent inside but allows you to set that frame on top of the photo. There are several ways you can adjust or rearrange the layering. Simply click on an item and then you can use your forward and backward buttons found along the top toolbar. So I could select forward or backward and you can see the items going behind or the frame is going behind. If I click on the forward button, now the frame is coming forward. I can also right click on it and bring it to the front. Now bringing it to the front will take it all the way to the very front, so on top of those flowers as well. Or you can send it all the way to the back. Now when you send something all the way to the back, it'll be on the very bottom layer, except it will not be below the background. The background is always the very lowest layer, 